Hey guys, Claude Johnson here from GuitarControl.com. Hope you're doing well today. You know, tomorrow's a special day because we're releasing our first ever reggae guitar course. It's called Reggae Roots Guitar Secrets, and it's from Steve Golding, who is a uh, Jamaican legend, in my opinion. He's uh, toured with Bob Marley, played with Peter Tosh, and uh, because we're in the reggae theme, I thought I'd take a minute to show you one of my favorite Bob tunes. Uh, it's called No Woman No Cry. So, before I jump right into it, just let me give you the link uh, for tomorrow's release. It's guitarcontrol.com slash reggae. So, go ahead and check that out. And let's just jump right into the lesson now. All right, so we'll start with the verse. And we've just got some real basic chords here. We've got a C, G, A minor, and F. So these are all pretty much basic open position chords. Um, if you're not familiar with that, uh, please check out my beginner course. It's at uh, guitarcontrol.com slash beginner. And, um, but basically it's just open chords. A minor, and then your F, you can either do this one, where I'm you know, barring the first two strings with this finger, playing four strings. Or you can do a full major bar chord with six strings. And the strum is going to be like, um, it's just like a four count strum. Actually, I'm doing like a little pickup before I go into the, you know, from the C to the G. And G. And A minor. Now, when I go from the A minor to the F, I'm actually going a full beat ahead. So, best way to explain this is if I were to count like four beats uh, per chord, it would be like one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So on that A minor, when I count the, when I land on the four, I actually switch chords and then play another full bar of F. So once again, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Okay? And if you want to add the lyrics, Alright, so that's basically the, the whole verse, it just keeps repeating. Now the chorus, it's the same thing except if you're going to add um, C, F, C at the end. So, and then G, you can add that little melodic line, so we have Alright, so I'll show you that in a sec, um, but just to show you how, the, how it fits together with the chorus, it's like... Okay, so what we're doing here, so I've got G on the low E string, third fret, and then I have open A string, second fret A string, and then back to the G. Okay? And so what I do is I strum it and go into that little lick. So once again, C, F, C, G, and then right back into the C, G, A minor, F. So that's pretty much it. All right, so I hope you enjoyed that lesson. And remember, just go to guitarcontrol.com slash reggae because tomorrow we're releasing Reggae Roots Guitar Secrets with Steve Golding. It's going to be an awesome course. So check it out, guitarcontrol.com slash reggae. And I'll catch you next time.